Hey everyone, this is Andrew Tai. Welcome to my YouTube channel. Today I have my iPad here, which I want to erase all my data from and be able to sell it or pass it on to someone new. So I want to be able to make sure everything's removed so that when the next person picks up this iPad, it's gonna be as if it's brand new and none of my data and none of my accounts are gonna be accessible by anyone else. And today I'm gonna to show you how to do that. So if you haven't subscribed already, then please consider subscribing and you'll be able to keep up to date with the latest tech tutorials. So the process of erasing is very, very simple. The first thing you should do is just make sure that you have a backup if you're gonna move it to a new iPad, make sure that you go to the iCloud settings and then you go to iCloud and then we make sure our iCloud backup is turned on and that our backup was completed recently. This will say here our backup was last completed yesterday at 2.33. That means we have a recent backup completed. So if we ever want to move to a new iPad, then we can do that easily with iCloud. However, if you don't want to retain your data, then we can move on to the next step. So the next thing we need to do is go to the settings menu and then we're going to go and scroll down to general. And then we're going to scroll down to here. And then what we want to do is press this button here, which says transfer or reset iPad. So I'm going to tap on this now. And now we have the option down here, which says erase all contents and settings. This is going to wipe everything, all of your data. So if you did want to back anything up, make sure you do a backup. So now we're going to press erase all contents and settings. And here it's saying it's going to erase my apps and data, my Apple ID, my activation lock. Here we're going to press continue. And then we're going to type in the passcode for this iPad. So just type that in. Now it's going to do a final update just to make sure that our latest iCloud backup is completed. If you didn't want to do this, you can always press skip backup. So now the iPad's asking for the activation lock. So that's your Apple ID password, which we're going to enter now. So here it's asking if we're sure we want to erase all the data, we're going to press erase iPad. So now the iPad is being completely wiped. Just wait for this to complete. So now the iPad has completed its reset process. And if we press the home button now, and it's going through the setup process just as if you bought the iPad new. So this iPad is now ready to list on eBay or to give it to somebody. It's wiped of all your data and applications and it's ready to use by a new person. So anyway, I hope you found this video useful. If you did, please like, please subscribe, and I'll see you in the next video.